So today we got to talk about BitGert Prize because Prize has actually a lot of good news going on for it and some major exchange listings coming soon. So this is pretty big. That's what we're going to go over today. So go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe. Remember, I'm not a financial advisor. None of this is financial advice. Leave a comment in the comment section, all that good stuff. And let's get straight to it. So let's talk about BitGert. So there's a lot of good things going on with BitGert right now. And one of the main things is this exchange listing. So we're having a huge exchange, a lot of huge exchange listings at that actually. 10 major crypto exchange listings, as they say, 10 major ones. So it's pretty big. I don't know if they're going to be tier one, tier two, or tier three. But since they said major should be tier one. But I don't believe there is more than 10 tier one crypto exchanges. So I think they're going to be tier one and tier two exchanges. So this is going to be pretty big and it's going to start on August 1st. So it's going to go all the way out till the 27th or no, till the 30th of August. So from the 1st to the 5th to the 9th to the 12th to the 17th to the 20th to the 24th to the 27th to the 30th. And they have them all lined up. So this is pretty big news for BitGert. And I think uh, this is going to be really good. I think that it could help the price increase. Um, Bryce has been going down within the last, I would say, years. It is down in 33% in the last year. Everything's down in the last year, though, so you can't really give it that type of uh, perspective. But within the last 180 days, it still has been going down, and you can kind of see it here on the chart. It has been on a straight downtrend since February, but I think this could be good now that we have all of these exchange listings. This is almost like a discount price for all the people that are trying to get into Bitgirt. So I think this is going to be good for the Bryce community and especially with all the different um, all the different exchanges. So money should start flowing into Bitgirt very soon. So we should be seeing that pretty soon. And also, if you're wondering what these indicators are, they are the chart prime indicators. You can go ahead and click the link in the description for chartprime.com. Go ahead and click that link and you will go ahead and get this. Uh, these indicators for trading view. They're actually pretty, pretty good. And right now, what it's looking like with Bryce, it's looking like we're about to have a breakout here. And it's kind of congruent with our exchange listings because the first one's going to be on August 1st. And you can see here with this wedge pattern, they're actually about to break out on the upside here. So we just got to get above the momentum wave bands here, which are the red bands and the green band down here. So we got to get past the momentum wave band and build that momentum so we can go out from there. But it does look like we are going to break out from this area here into a positive pattern. That's what it looks like. Like I said, not 100% sure if we are going to actually do that. But according to what they're doing here on August 1st, starting with the exchange listings, I think there's a huge possibility that we get a nice pump coming in for buys. So that's pretty much what I'm preparing for now. And uh, moving on from that, though, you can also see the weekly report here. Bryce is now live on Ethereum and verified on Etherscan as well. So there's already 655 holders here for Bryce on Etherscan. So, yeah, that's a lot of different holders on Ethereum now. And, yeah, uh, for the last 14 days, as you can see, it was first deployed in, within the last 14 days. And, yeah, we've now had it live for uh, two weeks now. So it's pretty good, the fact that we now have buys on Ethereum. So they're really expanding it and making this a true multi-chain project. So we have a lot. We have our own for Bitgert, and then we have Binance Smart Chain, and now we got Ethereum, Etherskin, and we're gonna get more and more and more. So this is actually pretty good. So shout out to them for doing that. Uh, moving on from this though, we also have a little bit more news for this. We were trending on CoinGecko earlier this week um, with some new partnerships as well as the staking upgrades and the buyback burns. And then we have some other smaller minuscule things down here, such as the AMA with the DTC group, $1,000 prize for most likes, meme character announcement, announcement as best crypto project on BNB chain for the past 24 hours, recognized by Bybit as top 11 blockchains, and promo campaign announcement and integration announcement on the XOX Labs. So there has been some recent updates here with Bryze. So yeah, Bitgirl has been doing fairly, fairly well. It's only a matter of time until the first exchange comes out, which is going to be on August 1st. So that's going to be pretty good as well. And I hope, hopefully they have some more new updates 
for the Bryce Paradise. I don't think that there has been many new updates for Bryce Paradise. But uh, yeah, don't mark me on that. Hopefully they do something with it because I know a lot of people <laughs> have been waiting for this and waiting for this to come out. But it takes a while to develop a hotel and it takes a while to develop stuff like that. But this was released on June 25th. And they said that they are proud to announce that our hotel's concrete structure is 100% completed. This is a huge milestone that shows the dedication and commitment from the team, um, from the Bryce Paradise team and committed investors. And they said they're currently preparing to finalize funding and sourcing the materials. You got to remember, this is out inside the Maldives, so it's a pretty far way to send materials out there. And it costs a lot to ship materials out there as well. And it said for all the work that's come from this point onwards to starting of operations such as bricks, sand, cement, flooring, plumbing, electrical works. So now they're going to be closing in on this hotel and they're going to be getting some walls done. They're going to be getting plumbing, electricity, uh, floors, cement, bricks, everything and furnishing. So this is pretty good. We'll have to wait and see exactly what happens. But yeah, this this has taken a good amount of time to get to this point. But they have announced that it is finally done with the um, the structure, the concrete structure. So it's pretty exciting to see. Hopefully we see some more news coming from this very soon. But yeah, anyways, enough of that. Like I was saying before, the price of Bryce should have an increase. We're at 2.7% up for the last 24 hours. $1.258 million in the last 24 hours. And the market cap at $100.8 million. So hopefully we can have uh, a nice increase in the price here with fries. So this is pretty much all I got for you all today. So let me know what you think about this. Let me know what you think about the exchange listings. What exchange listings do you think that they're going to be listing onto? Because they're going to be listing onto 10 major exchanges, as they said. So we'll have to see which ones that they're trying to get listed on. But anyways, if you want these technical indicators, go ahead and check out the link in the description in the first comment for chartprime.com. Go ahead and click that link. You can go ahead and get these technical indicators, very good indicators. And this is all I got for you all today. And as always, I'll be back with another video.